Hey, it's Caleb here at homeschool-curriculum.org. And do you ever get frustrated with your curriculum or maybe worry that you're going to choose the wrong curriculum? Well, we had a problem with our math curriculum recently where, you know, we were doing a workbook and well, it feels good to go through the pages and get the workbook done, and our son was just chugging through it. I worried about his retention. I wasn't pleased with what I saw for results. In fact, I kind of asked him spot questions, and there was just no connection. So I started looking for a math curriculum that could really work for us, and I found one I really like. We've been using it for a while now, uh, over a month, maybe two months now, and I really enjoy the results we're seeing as well as how we're engaging in math. Because before we were saying, he was saying, well, why do I have to learn this? It's not relevant. And now we're doing these math problems and he, we're able to have a conversation that comes a lot closer to home about the relevance of it. The product is called Right Start. I'm holding up their lesson book for one of the levels, Right Start Mathematics. And I've got a link to how you can get to their page and everything to see in detail. But I'll go through some of the things I like, some things that I don't really like, and then some suggestions I have about how you might get started. So the first one I like is this lesson book. This lesson book here, it's got over 140, it's got 140 different lessons. So it's got a school year of lessons. And because we changed midway through the year, we're doing two lessons a day until I think that we caught up to about where I'd like to see for progress for the year because of how we switch. But in here, there's also a section called General Thoughts on Teaching Mathematics. And there are 27 different points here on this General Thoughts on Teaching Mathematics. And here's one, you know, one of the points they say, real learning builds on what the child already knows, rote teaching ignores it. And I like these thoughts. They're good uh, for us to consider, but it just goes along with the core of what Right Start Mathematics is about. The other one I like about uh, Right Start is the manipulatives. Uh, they come with a lot of manipulatives. In front of me I have some centimeter cubes that are... Um, holding together. We were just using it for something we're doing. And I gotta say, I like this clock. It's kind of geeky about me, but what I like about the clock is that as I move the minute hand, the hour hand advances at the same time. So it's not one of these paper clocks you say, I gotta move the hour hand and the minute hand. So that allows us to talk about how time advances. And that's, uh, means it's a quality piece, a manipulative something you can handle. It's a quality uh, piece we use for learning and explaining how time works. The set, there's a whole bunch more, and you'll see it on the site when you look at it, a whole bunch more manipulatives of things that come with this set. In front of me I have some cards, we were just playing a game, so I like the games that they create to reinforce the lesson. But when you look at this whole set, you'll see there's just so many things that you could use. In that set is a DVD that explains some of the games and some of the ways to use Right Start Mathematics. So I really like that as well. Um, along with the lesson book comes a worksheet book. So yes, there are some worksheets to reinforce the lessons, but really the way it works is generally we'll go over something we learned the day before. We'll do a little bit of learning about today's topic. We'll do maybe a worksheet, and then we'll play a game, and then we'll wrap it all up. And we get done in about 20 or 30 minutes, depending on attentiveness and how much fun we're having. Some of the games will play another round because we're naturally uh, competitive. This is a book that comes in there, and these are the math card games. Uh, so a bunch of different games here. There are, let's see, looks like 100 and 140, 150 pages of games that you could use to reinforce the learning. And for me, that makes it a lot more relevant, a lot more fun, and we're just exchanging numbers around. Now, the pricing can vary because you have to buy the initial kit with all the different, you know, the manipulatives, these cards, the, you know, the clock, and there's other things in, in there, and you'll see that on the site. And then you buy the workbooks for your level, and you, you can see on the site how you do the level. I'll talk through that in a second. Um, what you got to do is you go to the site, you take a look at where you are, and where you think you are, and you buy the workbooks for that level. There's a self-assessment, you can take them. I emailed off to the company and their customer support was awesome. They responded very quickly and they just said, hey, this is probably where your child is, start there. And they were right. And we started there, we're covering some stuff he already knows, but we're also covering it in a different way. So it helps for him to learn even more. Looking at my notes here, so the way you would get started here is you would verify your level, check the assessment, contact support if you need to, you would order, and then I would start with the first lesson and just work through that. And if it's middle of the way through the year, you can decide to either offset your year or do two a day. It's not that hard to do that and crank right through it. 
So that's Right Start Mathematics. I'm pretty pleased with it. I recommend it to you to, to try it out in your homeschooling as well. That's it for today. Thanks a lot.